story in most parts of the world, street art never lasts. You know, most most places have laws in place where you know street art is cleaned up after a few days, a few weeks, etc., painted over. Um, and that's one of the fun things about trying to find interesting street art is because it pops up all over the city in unexpected places. And part of the fun is trying to find where they are or coming across them. What I love about tonight is the feeling that, that I'm part of a community that is into underground um, art. So excited by seeing live art, performance art happening as we walk down King Street. What I love about street art is that it's temporary. Um, and so you're either in the moment and you see it and you capture it, or you don't. You know, it just lasts. And that's kind of the romanticism about it, you know. The artists will find new ways of creating street art to kind of subvert or go around that kind of limitation. And it might make some more creative and more interesting art. That can only be exciting for us, right? I love the passion. The passion and the love and the dedication. The, uh, the dedication to, to each artist. I think it's looking at different perspectives of artists' views and being able to exhibit in different forums. I think it makes it accessible to whole new audience groups. I think it's just sensational. It's given city street art a platform.